Hello music fans, it's Brennan here from Death by Unicorn. Um, a while back I made some videos of my uh, top three favorite albums from every year in the 2000s. Uh, and now I figured uh, I've still got time, It's still uh, there's still a pandemic happening, so maybe I'll do the 90s. Um, so I'm going to start this video here uh, with my favorite albums from the year 1990, and I'm going to work my way up all the way to 1999. And uh, if this goes well, and if I still feel like I have time and want to do more of these, I might do the 80s and 70s next. Uh, so 1990, my favorite album of this year is Painkiller by Judas Priest. And yeah, this is my favorite album by these heavy metal gods. And that's saying something because they've put out 18 albums, um, with their first being way back in 1974. Uh, the guitarists are awesome, solos are great, vocals are soaring, the hooks are memorable. I'm not sure what else I can say. Uh, my number two album from 1990 is Rust in Peace by Megadeth. And this is one of the best Megadeth albums and probably one of the best thrash metal albums in general. Um, a lot of people might say it's the best from Megadeth, and I can see why. Uh, for me now, it's it's probably their second best, because uh, I've been kind of digging Euthanasia a little more right now, and I know that might be blasphemy, but of course I love both albums. And my number three album from 1990 is Frizzle Fry by Primus. This is their debut studio album, and they're a strange experimental alternative funk metal band that has some progressive rock influences. And yeah, I always love playing that song, John the Fisherman on Guitar Hero, so uh, shout out to Guitar Hero for that one. And uh, I'm going to give a few honorable mentions. I think just two honorable mentions for this year. Um, Slaves and Masters by Deep Purple. This is their 13th album. It's a solid hard rock album. Uh, not their best work, but uh, but they're always worth listening to whenever they put something out. And my last honorable mention will be No Prayer from the Dying by Iron Maiden. That's their eighth album. They're heavy metal legends. And again, it's not their best work, but they're always worth checking out. I hope you found something new. Maybe share some of your albums that you like from 1990. I might have missed some, uh, but those are the ones that, that I could think of.